Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. I've got mail. I didn't turn off the game and turn it back on again, though, so maybe it's something different. Manual secret techniques. Jump and spin, jump and spin! While jumping and spinning in midair, we'll show you all sorts of secret places, as I showed in B-Town. <laughs> so says the wisdom of the bunny chai. Boing. Star bunny. <laughs> Come see me next time, there's a mail delivery! Okay... So now we're gonna go straight up, over here, back to Haunty Halls, because... We've seen the last part, there's a Prankster Comet... And it's transforming the galaxy! Spooky Cosmic Clone, jeez! Of course, it's the Cosmic Clones! Always with the Cosmic Clones! So it's probably just get to the end of this stinker while avoiding everything, including the Cosmic Clones. Yeah, oh yeah, it's starting way over here in the level, so that's actually pretty close to the end. And the chase probably begins after I get to a certain point. Oh, there it goes! <laughs> so be careful not to... Oh shoot, I was going to say be careful not to fall to your doom, but... Well, but well... I failed. <laughs> that was a very quick fail. Uh, this is, is this treadmill faster than it was before? I think it is. Because <laughs> I'm having an awful lot of trouble getting some leeway here. Dang it, guys. Dang it, guys. Oh, shoot. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely faster than it was before. I don't think I noticed that before when I first played this. Probably because I was just kind of long jumping my way through it to avoid the... Cosmic clones. <laughs> mm, okay. There we go. And you notice that you can indeed jump on top of the matter molds, but you know, it's not really the safest thing to do, I would say, because of the whole, you know, bottomless pit thing. This one doesn't feel faster than the other one. It feels just as slow as it did before. Okay. Let's do our hops. Woo! Oh yeah, like a pro. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be troublesome. <laughs> because the cosmic clones are going to be... Okay. Because they're going to flood that little little island here. And I'll just get the star bits from a distance if I can. Oh, yeah. Delicious. Delicious star bits. <laughs> now we can call this place complete. Oh, yeah. I like that sound. <laughs> well, I mean the sound of the word complete. Plus this sound effect coming up right here. Yeah! It tickles my OCD. <laughs> Alrighty, next galaxy. I gotta pay a couple of star bits to unlock it though. Oh uh, wait, actually... Mm, actually... I'll go down to this one. Rolling Masterpiece Galaxy. Because I don't think that... This leads... To, well, I mean, it will lead to the end, I think, but I think that there is a... that the other one just would normally lead to the castle, like, through a paywall. <laughs> Not like actual money, nasty microtransaction paywall. I mean, Starbit paywall. <laughs> Silver Chomp Grudge Match at Rolling Masterpiece Galaxy. You might remember these from the first Super Mario Galaxy. Hey, it's me, Billboard! If you want to ride on the Star Ball, listen up! Tutorial time. Okay, first thing you do is jump on the Star Ball. Yeah! Alright, so you made it aboard. I'll take it and hold it straight up, like this. Oh, oh, yeah! It's like a joystick in a way. Like a floating joystick in your hand, I guess you could say. That's it, think of that as your starting position. From that starting position, Tilt forward to start rolling forward. Press A to jump. You can also smoosh things that get in your way. Enough chatter though, go ahead and give it a try. You'll get the hang of it. Oh yeah, look at me go. Smooshing billboard too. Oh, I can't smoosh billboard, can I? Just kind of, kind of the flex. Oh, I can't smoosh them! <laughs> Alright, we're off. Go in here. And then the real test begins! There's a whole bunch of paintbrushes stuck to this planet here, and we gotta navigate ourselves through this maze here. I, I would not only be pointing at these, but, you know, due to floating joystick controls, I'm kinda pointing at the ceiling right now. 
but I can indeed roll myself around to collect them, which works almost as well. Well, not nearly as efficient. <laughs> Alright, let's kill the Goombas. Maybe, just maybe, we'll get a prize from doing so. You never know, right? 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 Come on, everyone, everyone's gotta go. This planet is not big enough for the ten of us. <laughs> so yeah, you'll see that these, there's, yeah, there's these cases with the key. So we're, we're just kind of rolling around looking for said key somewhere around these parts, wherever it might be. I'm just trying to explore as much of it as I possibly can, though. Hey there, Goombas. How's it going? Probably not that good now that I've squished you. Hmm. Where is that key on this rather large, slightly maze-like planet? Hmm. 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 <laughs> By the way, you'll notice that the music changes pace depending on how fast you're going. Listen closely. Slow down. Slow down. Yep. <laughs> also pitch and tone and stuff like that. Yeah, where is that key? What am I missing here? I killed all the stuff. I thought I explored everything here. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I don't think I can use that to break the case. As tempting as it may be. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, seriously, what am I... Where am I missing its location here? <laughs> I'm not even seeing it, like, floating in midair or something like that. You know, like a shadow or whatnot. Hmm. Maybe the key is to get all the star bits. Nah, I don't think so. Oh, there it is. How did I go around the planet 80 times and still miss that? Because, I mean, did I just, like, lose track of it because the paintbrush is kind of messing with my vision or something? Because I, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just move on. <laughs> Flower landing? Well, it's more like paint palette landing, at least. I think that's what it is. Uh, probably not worth pointing at these. Uh, I think they ought I think they, over time, they kind of fall on their own, so I probably shouldn't mess around with that too much. <laughs> like, they disappear from under your feet, well, under your ball, on their own, so yeah. Uh, to do this, I am going to go around, and there we go. Voila! I'm on a ruler! <laughs> oh, wait, I can point at those now, I'm stuck in place! <laughs> Star bits! Star bits! Okay. We're good. Grinder is gonna be cutting holes and stuff. You are not allowed to cut hole where that is. Oh no, you don't! You monstrosities, you! And there's a, since they're cutting away all of your flooring here, it's not really a good idea to mess mess around too badly here. <laughs> Man, all this trouble just for the star that we're that we've already collected since the beginning, technically. But we can't get it out of this ball. How the heck do we get it out of this ball, anyway? Well, it's coming, I, I assure you. Oh, man! Silver Chomp! Silver Chomp! Bounce it off the edge. It is its destiny to fall off the edge. And then a pathway opens for you. <laughs> Down the track! Into the middle! And away it goes! <laughs> yeah! Such beauty. Such beauty. Yeah, I don't know how I how I failed to find that key though for an hour. <laughs> okay, it wasn't an hour. There were there were no cuts there, obviously. <laughs> but still, but still, a mystery. Complete though. <laughs> At least for now, until a prankster comet pops on over there. I think that the uh, split path after that flower paint palette, you know, with those blocks that pop into place just contain the one-up, if I recall correctly. So it's not that big of a deal or anything like that. Alright. Alright. Uh-oh. <laughs> a letter addressed to the baby Luma! To the Luma baby Luma has arrived! <laughs> had to read it that way. To my lost Luma, we worry about you. But we know you are safe with your new friend. I hope the attached item is helpful. May the stars shine down on you. Thank you. Thank you. 
Wow, there are 50 star bits attached to that letter. They're to an address, but I hope to get to meet this mysterious person soon. Maybe someday. Maybe someday. Alright. Uh, so I guess we do actually have to feed the Luma. <laughs> to actually open up the regular path to the castle. Actually, wait a second. Maybe this will. Oh, this unlocks Beat Block Galaxy. I remember now. So, yeah, let's feed it a thousand star bits. We've been accumulating those bad boys. You better believe I have those star bits. And you are going to defend those star bits. Yeah! <laughs> I like that little delay at the end. That's so. Oh, so fun. I think I'm about to transform! So yeah, I, I, I just remember that when I went over here, that there is indeed another galaxy called Beat Block Galaxy. It's just, it's not just for an extra path, I mean a, a separate path. Yeah, Beat Block Galaxy. What is the Beat Block? Well, we are about to find out. See, there, there are these blocks and they go on timed intervals. And they're set to the beat of the song in the background. Step to the beep! <laughs> Let's do it! Watch the blocks. See how they switch them? Yeah, they switch colors to the beat of the music. So don't fall to your doom, but get in the groove! <laughs> also, grab your star bits. You can use these as sort of like a practice area, I guess you could say, to transition between between the two thusly, if you'd like to. You don't really have to, though. It's just, it's just like a little mini galaxy, and it's pretty easy to get the hang of it just playing it normally. <laughs> and switcheroo. We go. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. You're gonna try and knock me into the into the abyss, aren't you? And you know, oh! Well. Well, the Octuma most certainly was able to knock me into the abyss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's because I was air airborne when I got hit by the rock. So what happens? I flew farther than I would have normally had I not been in the air and I got hit by, by said rock. No big deal or anything like that. By the way, the Goom Beetles are on the yellow ones, and the Octumas are on the green ones. Got it? Good. <laughs> So they just kind of they switch with the beat just as well. There we go. Oh shoot! No, no, no. What's wrong with me? <laughs> I totally missed my landing as to where I knew it was. I tried aiming for it so I could just immediately land on it, and I ended up getting a rock in the face. <laughs> it's okay though. We are good. This isn't a difficult galaxy, really. I'm just messing up badly. <laughs> <laughs> ah, we're, we're already back to where we were. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna actually... Wah, just like so. Uh, but that Comet Metal we most certainly want... Ooh, yeah! <laughs> and, okay, let's take a look-see what that other path is like, though. Just really quick. I think it's just an optional place if you're jumping for the Comet Metal that way. Uh, yeah, it sure looks like it. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, I guess, I guess just the one-up. Not a big deal or anything like that. Alright, let's continue on the path. It's lots more linear from here. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna actually go and see what's inside this box. I was gonna say see what's inside this box, but I'm not, I don't think I'll have enough time with the beat this time. It's probably just Star Bits. Probably. Yeah, Star Bits. Star Bits are nice, though. Um... Uh, okay, so now what we're aiming to here is to get the Silver Stars, of course. Which, while it seems pretty treacherous, as long as you're relatively careful about it, you should be okay. <laughs> should be. That is the key word. Woo! Let's zip down this away. And then I- oh no, you- I said careful, PK Gam! <laughs> and 
And we're back to the beginning of this star run. Alas, alas. At least we got a checkpoint so we don't start from the beginning of the beginning of the world. <laughs> like before when I when I kept getting rocks in the face. The little Optumbas are placed strangely well. <laughs> okay. Uh, I probably should kill off any of them that I see. That would that would that would be pretty handy for one thing. Wait a second, wait a second. <laughs> okay, got four, and all I have to do is make my way back to the center for that last one. On yellow, there we go. And also, of course, you know, we gotta get to the top of the star, so it's still not over! <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Oh wait, it stopped? It stopped! The music stopped! It's... what? This can't be! I mean, granted, it's still not over, because you gotta avoid the bottomless pits, but still! <laughs> Alright, now... The big bad galaxy at the end, unless... We get another comet. Which we just might get another comet. <laughs> because then, I I'll feel obligated to go and milk out the comets like I was doing before. Uh, oh, yep, there's a comet! <laughs> Rolling Masterpiece Galaxy. Okay, so it's not to the end of the world just yet. Letter? Oh, no. Race, race! Race to get wild like galaxy! Don't check it out! Don't check it out! Come on, don't wait! Don't wait! Jibber day! I guess I'll do that one next part, probably. Yeah, it's all be at Wild Glide Galaxy, and we're a lot closer to, you know, this other galaxy over here, <laughs> Rolling Masterpiece. So let's go ahead and do our Prankster Comet Challenge of Doom, and it could very well be Doom when you've got controls like running on this ball. It's a speed run! <laughs> well, I see a lot of lives lost on this one. Especially since there won't be any checkpoints. <laughs> Alright, here we go! I think that was a whole other planet to come across there this time. Two minutes! Go! <laughs> no time to wait! Collect the star bits though! <laughs> as long as you're safely in place. Okay, now at least I know that the key on this planet, you know, that I was fumbling around on, is uh, around the corners... Uh, this... Oh... Wait... <laughs> I say this way... <laughs> at least I thought it was. Oh, 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 oh it's in a different spot! You are being tricky there, Comet Metal. <laughs> I mean, uh, Comet... A prankster Comet. Well, I guess that is... It's living up to its name as a prankster Comet. Okay, I need to get over to their post haste. <laughs> yeah! And Sarbets? Yes, yes, yes. Oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, I just, I've gotta see here what's over. It is just a one up, okay. Not that special. Go, go, go! <laughs> Squish all the Goombas! If you want to, you don't have to. Uh, wait, I should be pointing at this stuff a little bit. <laughs> 49 seconds to doom, maybe. Oh boy. <laughs> go, 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 go. I'm not sure I have enough time, but we'll see. Yeah, I think this is actually... It's, yeah, it's new, I think. And it looks familiar. I think this is from the first Galaxy game, actually. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're at the place we need to be. We need to get it in to the abyss bully style before our time is up. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. I'm not sure this is gonna work. Oh, oh. Ee, ee. Yeah, especially since I gotta get it inside the track on the other side. <laughs> this is gonna be a toughie. But I am up for the challenge. Two minutes. Go, go, go once again. <laughs> and it'll be especially helpful that I know where that key is, but not that I had trouble finding the key this time. 
like I had the, uh, the other time when I wasn't in a speed run. It was just a thing of that. Yeah, <laughs> I don't, I don't know what even happened there. So looking for the blue side. There we go. And back to the tippy top with all the brushes. Well, I shouldn't, I shouldn't call anything a top when you're, when you have gravity issues like this. <laughs> well, actually, no, there isn't any gravity issues going on here. Come to think of it. Okay, no wasting time checking to see the one-ups that are completely useless to us. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna grab Star Bits though, just because. Yeah, Star Bits! Yeah, Star Bits! And hurry, 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 go, 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 go! You'll notice that I'm trying to touch these without overlapping a run, basically, so I don't have any sort of ire uh, of hitting one switch off and then, you know, having the issues all over again of having to go back, back and forth between them. <clears throat> what is this, though? Uh, oh, that's... Uh... Do I dare get them all? Maybe. I think this is gonna... Ah, yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> okay, it's a bunch of one-ups. Delightful. <laughs> that was totally worth it. <laughs> okay, over the edge you go. You monstrosity, you! That messed me up good. Oh, I got it quickly this time. Okay, that's nice. That's very nice because this is the end! <laughs> yeah! Please tell me that stopped the timer. <laughs> okay, it did. <laughs> that would be a little scary if it didn't stop the timer and then you had like three seconds left to get up to the top of the pole. <laughs> Alrighty. I say. <laughs> and with that, well, actually, let's see if there's any cutscenes. I was gonna say I'm gonna end off the part here, but there might be some, some other comet that'll appear too. Oh wow! Oh wow! <laughs> Over there, of all places, that could be interesting. But all right, now that we know that is there, I'll do that plus the wild glide one and the next up castle in the next part. So I hope you enjoy, and I will see you then.